Welcome back. Today on Dialed In DIY, I'm making a fun string of LED decorative lights using mostly recycled materials. I have found that at different times of the year, some of my favorite beverages come in some really unique containers. This particular Diet Coke bottle seemed to scream out to me, turn me into some kind of an ornament. That's why today I'm stringing a few of these together to make a really cool little set of lights that can be nice for any time of the year. You can see the materials I'll be using here, but I'll also put a list of them in the description below. I'll be using a pretty easy setup for all of my LEDs as you can see pictured here. If you do want more information on LEDs and how to set them up, Look to the description below for links to some previous videos that I've done for complete tutorials from beginner to intermediate. If you really want to simplify your design for this build, simply check out an online LED calculator. If you want more information about that one, I've also done a recent video on that which can also be found in the description below. Using one of those online LED calculators are great, especially if you're not too familiar or comfortable with the use of resistors on LEDs. It makes your decision really easy. In my case, I did my calculations manually, so I wanted to test it out on a breadboard before I hooked everything up. For each of the LEDs that I'll be using today, I'm hooking up a resistor directly to the positive lead on the LED. You can either solder or use electrical tape to close off your connections, but I like to go back with heat shrink tube, throw a piece over the end, and then hit it with a hair dryer to shrink it down so it keeps everything well protected. Preparing the bottles is actually really easy. First, all you have to do is clean out the bottle, then remove the cap and put a hole big enough in the top just so you can slide the wires through. Since we want the light on the inside of the bottle, I'm running the wires through the inside of the cap. Once I have it secured, I'm then going to just set everything down inside the bottle and screw the cap back in place. When I came up with this design, I wanted to use it as an extra set of lights hooked into another string, so I used a regular plug that came off an old phone charger. However, if I wanted to use it around my desk, I could also hook it up to USB power. With each of the four bottles prepared, all I needed to do was space them out about eight inches and then connect all my negative connections together and all my positive connections together. Just do note that before I secured them, I slid a piece of heat shrink in between each of the sections so that I could slide it over the completed wires and shrink it down when I'm done to protect everything yet again. With my power cables connected, everything turned out to be a really cool little decoration that turned out to provide some nice light too. Thanks for stopping by Dialed In DIY today and checking out my decorative light string design. If you liked it, please let me know with a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like this, please feel free to check out my playlists and look for some of the other LED designs. And please subscribe while you're here. And come on back in the future because there will be plenty more Dialed In DIY to come.